I'm always impressed by Elizabeth Warren, our old friend, because she has this sort of almost unique ability to say things that are not true multiple times in a single sentence. It kind of boggles the mind sometimes. She would perhaps call this misinformation is, is the word of the day. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and take a quick look at a recent clip that I found in which she's, well, talking again. In Massachusetts right now, those crisis pregnancy centers that are there to fool people who are looking for pregnancy termination help. Okay, let's just stop right there. Um, the crisis pregnancy centers are not there to fool women. They are there to provide women with resources when they are in a state of crisis that is related to the fact that they are pregnant, as the name might imply. So they'll help women to ascertain whether or not they are in fact pregnant. They'll provide un ultrasounds a lot of times. Some will help them to uh, get connected to Medicare and different resources so that they can actually get coverage so that they don't have to worry about the medical uh, fees. A lot of them will provide uh, uh, diapers and formula help. This is what crisis pregnancy centers actually do. No, they do not provide abortions. That is the only thing really that they don't do, is provide abortions. But to Elizabeth Warren, that's somehow an injustice. I don't know how you think like this, but that's her. Let's continue. Outnumber true abortion clinics by three to one. Firstly, I don't know what a true abortion clinic is. It's not like the others are just fake abortion clinics. They're pregnancy crisis centers. Um, just because it's a crisis, because you're, you're poor and you weren't expecting to be pregnant, doesn't mean that you want to kill the child. That's just kind of this weird um, false dichotomy there. Anyway, so she claims that the pregnancy crisis centers outnumber abortion clinics by three to one. Why is that a bad thing? It's fabulous. It means that there are tons of resources available for these women who are in a time of need. Because these are women who, for one reason or another, are scared and are looking for resources and need the help. And the help is being provided. There are three times as many of these clinics than abortion clinics. That's a good thing? Not to her. She wants all death clinics, I guess. We need to shut them down here in Massachusetts and we need to shut them down all around the country. You should not be able to torture a pregnant person like that. A pregnant person, she says. <laughs> we tend to call those pregnant women where I come from, but you know, pregnant person. She's already got the lingo just, just right, you know, because she wouldn't want to use the word woman when talking about these pregnant women. That would be atrocious somehow. But really, the entire clip there was just so wrong in so many ways. Because like these clinics provide a tremendous service uh, to women, and it's these clinics, by the way, that are being you know firebombed throughout the country, and that the mainstream media and those on the left are looking away from as they're being terrorized and attacked for providing a really noble uh, charitable cause, and. It's like, you look at people like Elizabeth Warren and she's saying such things at the same time that you've got these different clinics being attacked. Well, she's sort of providing the reasoning there because these clinics aren't good. They're just trying to fool women. Oh, sorry, fool people. We don't say women anymore because somehow that's, that's a bad thing. Women no longer exist. And that's for the good of I, I don't know who. This is the modern left's logic and it's absolutely evil. Her essential basis of thought here is if you're not willing to to kill the baby in the womb, then you shouldn't exist. And that we should use the power of the government and the state to shut those clinics down. That's evil. If you liked that video enough to make it to the end of the video, which is like superhuman in terms of modern attention spans, please make sure to share this with your friends and family. I also have links in the description so you can follow me elsewhere and you can find other videos. Thanks.